Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to show you how to import and export brushes in the app Infinite Painter. So, this is my Infinite Painter app. And here I will show you how to import the brush first and then I will show you how to export them. So, uh, I recently came across this website where you can download a free set of infinite printer brush uh, it consists of three brushes so i will share the link of this brush set uh, website in the uh, description and you can click on that and you can uh, you know it directs you straight to this uh, website so here uh, actually I have already uh, came to this website and downloaded the files so uh, I'm not able to show you exactly how to download but I will tell the procedures here so here when you come to this website uh, here you can see there is a uh, place for uh, adding some dollars so if you uh, you know if you want to uh, pay some uh, uh, you know price then you can do that otherwise you can simply download uh, these brushes for free if you want to download for free just click on this I want this option when you click on this it will be re uh, redirected to another page where you can uh, mention your email ID in the email ID section and click the I want this uh, tab uh, a button uh, the files will be uh, downloaded immediately to your uh, uh, device so in that way you have to download this brush also if you find any other brush you can just click and download in, uh, um, and you'll get that files so my files are here in the download section here you can see infinite painter 3 brush pack so now I will show you how to uh, import that brush to your infinite painter app so here when you click on this file, you can see it is in the extension called .zip .zip, which means it is in the zip format, uh, compressed format, so you cannot import this brush directly to your app. So you, you have to extract the files and then you have to import to your file, uh, app. So to extract, long press this, not long press, just press on this and immediately it shows an option to extract just click on that extract and you, ha you can mention any name i'll uh, extract in the same name just click on this ex extract and when you extract uh, once you extracted the uh, zip file uh, the extension changes to dot p or is it p so this is how the extracted file looks like so now you don't have to uh, do anything here now i will show you how to import them to your uh, infinite painter app so here i'm inside the infinite painter app and to import the brush pack just click on this three dot and click on the import option and here choose files here choose my files and here comes the your file um, uh, options uh, actually if you downloaded the files from any website or gmail uh, then uh, it will be available under the download section but if you have downloaded uh, or shared the file uh, files from any device to this device using usb sometimes it may be available in some other section in such case just click on this recent file and you'll have the brushes back here you can either click on that recent files or if you have downloaded then you can find this in here uh, download section as well so whatever uh, in both ways just click on that uh, file and you have both zip format dot P or is it P format? Uh, so don't click on this zip extract uh, extension 
because that will be in the compressed format which cannot be uh, imported so if you want to import just click on this dot p or is it p format and select this now click on the done and here you can see it shows zip uh, z uh, file importer which means the brushes are imported here now here before if you check your default uh, brushes uh, here in the infinite painter app it will be like a new favorites creator in that way but now i have another pack at the top that is a tree pack just click on this and here is the downloaded brush they have provided with nine brushes different kind of tree brushes here so i will show you one by one this range Sixth one, sixth one. So uh, you, you can feel like these two brush looks similar, but you can see if th this is the brush, it will appear only when you are tapping on uh, some place like a stamp. But this is like a uh, you know a scattering brush. You get like this. Well, you drag in and this stamp brush appears only when you click in a particular place so that's the difference between stamp brush and another normal brush so next comes the coconut tree and this and this so these are the nine brushes that comes in that pack you can check out that website and download it easily and import that and yeah this is how you have to import the brush so now i will show you how to uh, export the brush also if you want to ex uh, import a single brush you can do in the same way there is no uh, changes just click on that uh, particular brush that you want to import and you can import using the, uh, this import option so this is how you can import now if you want to export a brush or a brush, a brush set or a brush pack uh, I will show you now so I have a brush that is created by me so this is a brick brush and it's in the fill uh, style which means here you can see there is a brush set called fills where you can find this kind of brushes so in the same way i have created my own brush textured brush and i have named that as a texture fill custom so now i will show you how to export this brush so when you want to export this brush go to that brush here is the brush that i want to export just long press this and you have the option called share share this and here you can see saved to document folder it comes like that then we go to your files and go to recent here you can find that brush texture full custom that i have exported now so this is how you have to export and you can share this uh, file to anyone or in your website and another way if you want to export the whole pack of that brush here you can see in the created i have three brushes totally so one is this texture brush so this is one and so this is the one of the brush and 
this is brush I, uh, I'm not well satisfied with these two brushes so uh, but I just created this long bag and here I will show you how to export them so as a set or as a pack if you want to export then what you have to do is instead of selecting long pressing a particular brush just click on this and long press here I have to export the created uh, pack there, so which means I have to long press the created click on the share and here it shows save to document folder then again go to your documents I mean my files the recent you can see created which means the uh, it is exported as a pack uh, like a set of three brushes and it is in the format of um, P-R-Z-P so which means uh, since it has multiple brushes it is in this format extension and if you export a single brush it will be in P-R-Z-R uh, and here you can see as we already uh, exported uh, you know imported a brush pack in that also you can see an extension called P or is it P which means it is as a pack so that's the extension difference so when it is a group it will be in P or is it P and when you export a single brush it will be in the extension P or is it M B R so this is how you have to uh, export the uh, brushes as a file then long press share through the uh, Google uh, Gmail or Drive or you can uh, just uh, you know add that files uh, to your website so that's how you can import and export brushes in Infinite Painter if you are new to my channel please check out all the videos you can find some useful information also um you know full art tutorials and if you feel confused just go to my playlist section and i will uh, uh you know share as a separate playlist for high paint and for infinite painter ibs paint days and also i have shared a few of my hand drawings paintings all those things so check out all the videos and thank you for watching